Hello and welcome to part one of the using the date and time in Python tutorial. So the first part is we're going to find out how we can get the time now in AM, PM format or 24 hour format. So let's get started. The first thing you need to do is you need to import date time, the date time module. And then all we need to do is go and get the time now by doing now equals date time dot date time dot now. And that will go and get go and get it and it's created an object which is a date time object and it contains all of the information about the date and the time now but it's not in a very pretty format so we need to format that uh, to make it look pretty so let me show you how we do that let's do the 24 hour format first so we do t24 equals now dot f time there we go and we need just need to specify what format we're going to do well, that's nice and easy. We do the percent time and a capital H to say that we need to do the hour in 24 hours. And then we do a capital M, which states that we need to do the minutes there afterwards. And we've also put a colon in between to say that I'm going to display a colon in between the two values. You can change that to a dash or whatever you want, really. And there we go. So now if we do we type t24 there is the time in 24 hour format uh, good so how do we do it in uh, you know am pm 12 hour format well a little bit more complicated uh, if we try and just do it straight up if we do now f time and let's do the other way of doing it so what we do here is we do the percent and this time we use a capital i and we do the minutes and this time what we do is we put a space at the end and we just put a dollar a, a percent sign and a lowercase p and now this time has what it's done is it's got 9 54 p.m it's got zero at the start of it which is a bit annoying because we don't normally say that but i'll show you how to get rid of that in a moment but we're just about there all we need to do now is get rid of that zero so we need to just change this, adapt this slightly, this code that we just done. Instead of just leaving it at that, what we do is we do a dot L strip at the end. And we just say, okay, if it's got a zero at the start of it, just chuck away the zero by stripping it away. Uh, we make sure you go on L strip, so it'll only strip away from the left. Otherwise, uh, on the right hand side, it's going to um, take away zero at the end there if it's got one. There we go. And now, if you do T12, there it is. There is the time in 12-hour format. There you go. Thank you very much.